Hi, welcome to Danny on the Ghost Special Season 2. I'm Danny. I received a request from one of my subscribers asking me to show her around on the surrounding area from my recent stay at Ruma Hotel. In this video, I'm going to show a walkthrough from Ruma Hotel to the nearby pavilion Kuala Lumpur shopping mall. Walkthrough begins in 9 seconds. As the distance from Ruma Hotel to Pavilion Kuala Lumpur is just less than 5 minutes, this video is not a long one. In the meantime, I will show you what you will see along the way and at the same time, we will walk you through from the back entrance to the Bukimintang main entrance of Pavilion Kuala Lumpur. Here we go. This is Jalan Kiaping and I'm heading to the junction of Jalan Pinang. This majestic glass building you see here is the Permata Sapura Tower. From this junction, if you walk straight, we'll head to KLCC Convention Center and further on, we'll lead to KLCC Twin Tower. Now, I am following the left side of the road to go to Pavilion Kuala Lumpur. It's just after rain and in this evening, it's fresh and bright here in Kuala Lumpur. Now it's about 5 p.m. and it's on weekdays, so it's rush hour in the city. As you can see, there are many cars around. On the right side, you see here is Wipeport Residences. Traffic is always heavy here. In this video, I'm not having any music as background so you may be able to feel how the city sounds like during peak hours. After this bus stop as you see beside here, on the left is the HLX Tower or what we used to know the Hong Leong Bank Headquarter. In front, you can see this white building is another famous branded hotel called Novotel Kuala Lumpur. Another highlight of the walkthrough is this restaurant called Hakka Restaurant in front of us. This is a Chinese cuisine restaurant that serves authentic Hakka delicacies. Very famous but only open at 6 pm. There are ample of parking inside the restaurant compound, so it's not a problem if you drive into this restaurant. One may have to queue for table after 7 pm as it is always crowded here. If you have no plan where to eat while staying around this area, you can try to visit this restaurant. 
As stated at the signboard, it is open since 1956, way before I was born. During that time, Kuala Lumpur was still not as developed city as now, surrounded by shops and forests. Today, everywhere is high-rise building surrounding this restaurant. The owner resists to sell this land to the government and private developer. Even the price offer was very good. I think the persistence of the owner really worth as this piece of land is priceless now. What's more, the restaurant earned a very good reputation in local and foreigners too. Let's move on. From here, just across the road in front is the pavilion Kuala Lumpur. I will cross the road and walk you through inside the mall. This is one of the entrance of Pavilion Kuala Lumpur, the Jalan Raja Chulan entrance. It's at the back of the mall. Unfortunately, the escalator is spoiled during my visit, so I have to climb up. Once on top is the pedestrian bridge that link from Pavilion Kuala Lumpur to KLCC Twin Tower which I will have another video showing the walkthrough to KLCC. So please subscribe so you will not miss any of my videos. Here we can see Raja Chulan Street or Jalan Raja Chulan, the street where most of big offices, buildings and hotels located. <laughs> On the other side is the continuous of the street where we'll lead to Bukit Bintang and Imbi Road at the far end. This place is the heart of the Golden Triangle of Kuala Lumpur. As you can see, I am now entering into the Pavilion Kuala Lumpur shopping mall back entrance. The Pavilion Kuala Lumpur was opened in 2007 and straight away it became one of the most famous landmark and shopping heaven in Kuala Lumpur. It has more than 550 stores inside this building where one can find almost anything from local to international branded goods here. I will now walk you through the back entrance of this mall to the main entrance where you will be connected to the Bukit Bintang area, the heart of the bustling city center.
Thank you for watching the walkthrough and hope you will like this video. Till then and I hope to see you again. Bye!